All right, I wanted to show you this uh, to give you an example of how good the RTX 3070 works in EV during uh, viewport rendering. Now I'm going to use this scene which I've used many 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 times and I use it because you know I can compare it to other stuff because I've, I've had different variations of this scene for a long time plus it's a creation of my own. This right here isn't an extremely complicated scene but it is you know a somewhat complicated scene. It's got a lot going on in it. So let me go ahead and put this in rendered view and of course this is EV and it's using volumetrics. I got outside uh, lighting which environment lighting plus I have right here which is an area light but it's being used as a portal also but let me uh, let me click on my camera here all right now I'm going to shift F to go into fly that way we can just kinda navigate through it Of course I do have some light bleed down at the edges and some of the geometry doesn't quite make sense yet but this is just a little scene that I work on every once in a while I change a lot of stuff about it just this is my, like my practice scene and my benchmark scene all in one I'm finally getting glass looking decent in EV of course these posters are actually emission and principle mixed along with a bump um, node because if you look at it real close you got kind of a 3d texture to it but it has accents to actually emit light because if I was to let's say back up here you can actually see it casting light onto the wall or reflecting light onto the wall and if you're interested in how I done that node setup uh, this is it let me slide this down that's pretty much it I got your image texture going into an emission node and a principal node and a bump node of course the bump node is plugged into the normal and then I have a mix node and the mix node is so I can essentially adjust how bright how bright it is on a slider you know I could use this but it actually in some ways it feels like you get more control of this direct using the mix shader and I pretty much uh, let me go back into fly and I'll get recentered. This one is pretty much set up the same way, although it doesn't look nearly as good because it doesn't have a lot of dark. But pretty much the node setup is the same. go back into fly but of course the render quality of course it's it's noisy and so forth and I mean you see the light rays here I mean we're literally inside the God rays or whatever you want to call them but it's actually rendering in my opinion pretty good of course you got more uh, especially being that this is uh, in real time you got more bleed through up here which I've done all the standard tricks to limit bleed through but I've never been able to get it to limit the bleed through completely unless I was to um, you know turn down the light outside light so much that I don't get enough light coming through to create the 
God rays. But yeah, EV has come a long way. The next thing I want to do on this uh, uh, project is make this computer look more <laughs> realistic. Right now, it's just base. It's just an extremely basic thing and it needs to be better it needs to be a lot better now I bet you're wondering what's outside <laughs> or what's through the door well the outside is through the door I do want to build the rest of the uh, property or house but I haven't got around to it of course those houses are just images because that's an HDRI but I have an actual deck that's made out of geometry of course it's not textured very well it's just textured so that you could see it through the window and then I have all these little mounds and hills that's made to help uh, hide the fact that it's an HDRI from inside the uh, uh, from looking out the windows but yeah this is about as simple as you can get in terms of lighting of course you can just keep going and going and going eventually you're just going to fall off the edge and then you're not moving anymore then oh, I'm way below go up there's my room way off in the distance and of course this is the one of the windows But anyway, I thought people may be interested in seeing how well the uh, EV works with the 3070 in real time, and that I guess that's a pretty good example. Later, people.